Here in our highly scientific nesting labs, there's no telling what DIY experiments we'll be taking on next. This week we'll be dissecting an old lampshade and converting it into a new lace lampshade. I hypothesize that this will be a successful aesthetic equation. Find an old lampshade that could use a little revamp. Pick out a sharp object, like an X-Acto knife, locate its seam, and carefully begin to disassemble it. And use your tool and hands to pull back your lampshade seam. Cut down the side seam of your shade. Use your scissors, your hands, and your patience to successfully remove both top and bottom metal circles. Scrape and cut away any remaining adhesive to get a clean metal structure for your new project. Now take a large piece of lace and take the old shade material and lay it on top to find the size you'll need for your new shade. Cut around it, leaving a 1-2 to two inch seam allowance. Take the top corner of the lace and the top of the metal circle and fold the lace over the metal and pin. Pin until you've gone all the way around. When you get to the unfinished edge, fold once and pin the folded edge to the other piece of lace. Reattach your top metal piece to your lamp base to make sure your lace is even. Take your other metal piece and get an extra set of hands to hold it in place at the bottom of your lace. Fold your lace under twice and pin so that your lace is holding up the metal piece. Measure the length so that the top and bottom are equidistant all the way around. Once your lace is completely pinned, detach from the base and bring it to your machine. Set your machine to a zigzag stitch and sew along your pinned lines being very careful not to hit your metal pieces. Once you've attached the top, move on down and sew a zigzag seam on the bottom. Now sew down your seam line. Hand sew any areas you couldn't reach with your machine to give your lace shade a finished quality. And voila! A new lace lampshade! We'll be back with more science when we return. Or someone else's apartment. We're gonna settle this once and for all. What? No. Huh. You're speaking true. Let's go to the phone! It's garbage! It's entertaining. Ugh, thanks. Here we are in another New York nest at Arlie Bordis's, the tidiest bachelor. Arlie has a lot of aesthetic vision and a really great grasp of color. Arlie's home is filled with incredible artwork by his brother Ivan Bordis, paired with an amazing Jean-Michel Basquiat print that finishes off his living room. He has some interesting artifacts and some really pretty things, but there's still plenty of dude up in this piece. As the tidiest bachelor, Arlie's apartment is immaculate, spotless. I would literally eat off his floor if only there'd been a snack candy. I wonder what he does when he's alone. This week's quick tip, display your Polaroid pictures in a grid pattern on your fridge or hang them up with old clothespins like forum member Mishai Bob. Thanks for joining us in the lab. And until next week. Remember, your nest needs you.